guys, I am Pixel Dan, and this is a review of the Grocery Gang Bug Strike Series 2 figures. I've been real anxious to take a look at these. I've been a big fan of everything Grocery Gang has been doing with their new line of action figures, and while these have been out for just a little while now, and many of you who are collecting these probably already have them, I still wanted to do a video to take a look at them because I've been specifically excited about this wave right here. Here. We've got some new characters joining the ranks of this very fun line. So in this roundup here, we've got the amazing hot dog here known as Grot Dog. We've got an ice cream character known as Captain Lice Scream. And we've got our villain, General Arak Attack. Very fun figures. I love the artwork up here at the top of the packaging of all of the card backs. Very cool stuff. And even if you rotate these around to the back side, we got great little bios uh, with some images of the action figures kind of showing off their action features. And right here, you can see the nice cross sell showing all of the figures in this Bug Strike series, including these very cool kind of glow in the dark repaints of some of our main characters. And we'll be taking a look at those very soon in another video. But first, why don't we go ahead and open up these three right here and get a good look at them outside of the packaging. Let's start by taking a look at our bad guys, shall we? We got a rack attack here. He is our spider and he is one bad looking dude. Check him out. Really cool sculpt. You can see multiple legs there. Uh, he's only got like six legs. So, you know, spiders would typically have eight, but it's okay. I will forgive them for that. He is still a very cool looking character. Look at all his eyes, the black eyes with the red pupils there. Very, very cool. Oh, you know what? I guess we can count these as arms too. So there we go. Two, four, six, eight. I don't know what I was thinking. You got to count the legs. So he is a spider. He's got all eight appendages there. Correction. I fixed it. He is so cool looking though. I love this guy all the way around. And it's cool because it's all articulated too. So you can see the, the bigger arms here are kind of like your normal arms. So they're ball jointed at the shoulders. You can move those around. But also we can move these smaller arms up and down here as well. And you got the nice ball joints at the thighs on the legs, so you can position those around as well. And you'll see that I just knocked one of the cool little accessories out of his hand up here. This is because these back hands have this cool little spring loaded mechanism. See how there's like a nice spring on the back arms there? Because he can throw these cool little squishy bugs. So check it out. It's like they're like wrapped up in spider webs cool little bugs like his own little guys that he can throw and they're squishy like actual grocery gang figures which is kind of cool so it's a neat little addition so you can just place those in his arms up here like this and say for example we want to launch those let's give that a shot so we can pull his arms back here and let him go boom look at that he just throws those things that is awesome let's try it again we'll do it from the side this time and fire boom wow i really rocketed those that is amazing and of course uh just like with all of the other grocery gang figures you do get the smaller version of them as well that is done in like the standard grocery gang style and the cool thing is is these little minis are exclusive to these figures so if you want to get these to add to the rest of your grocery gang collection you got to get the figures here these guys of course are squishy they've got the hole just like all of the other figures but you can see he's just like a smaller version of a rack attack so he is a really cool looking villain for the grocery gang next up let's look at lice cream now this is one that i was really excited about i love the idea of an ice cream cone guy and he is so cool i mean look at the details here he's a waffle cone first of all which is pretty spectacular and you can see he's like a scoop of chocolate ice cream he's got the little extra guy growing out of his head there which is amazing and one of the things i really like about this that i wasn't expecting he's removable and he's squishy so he's like his own little like tiny miniature uh, regular grocery gang figure and he just plugs there's a little peg right there and you can just easily plug him right back on his head how cool is that he does have nicely articulated arms he's got the legs as well i love kind of like the neapolitan colors going on here with like the chocolate syrup in between such a fun design of course he's an ice cream guy so his weapon is an ice cream scoop which is pretty amazing so he can whack the bad guy bugs with his ice cream scoop or maybe he can like throw them and toss them around and you get the smaller version of lice cream here as well in standard grocery gang style very cool but here's what's fun check this out he does have an action feature you might have noticed there's a little button on his back if we aim him and we press the button 
Boom! Look at that! You can actually fire off the scoop of ice cream. His head shoots right off. I love this because if you're an old school toy collector from the 80s like myself, these might remind you of Madball's head poppers. It's kind of the same thing. Look, boo! But it's much better because there's no spring here, so we shouldn't have to worry about this, um, you know, wearing out over time. I think it'll hold pretty good. Very easy to kind of clip it back in just like that. I love that. Look at that. You can just bounce it right up. Oh, it dropped on the floor. I'm going to have to find it. But man, such a fun figure. And next up, we have a Grot Dog. Another awesome character, right? A hot dog. Oh, it's amazing. And it's, again, another thing that really reminds me of that classic Food Fighters toy line that I grew up loving so much. This guy is amazing. He's got this very kind of punk look to him because he's got, like, the fingerless gloves with the spikes around the wrists. Uh, for some reason, he's wearing one tennis shoe and he's barefoot on the other side because why not? And I love the knee pads. You can see the mustard kind of squirted there on, like, this moldy-looking bun. Uh, I love the little tuft of hair on top as well and you'll see he's got this cool little mace weapon it's a spiked mace made out of an onion look at that and his action feature is this he's got a spring-loaded uh, arm on the right side so he's got this little spike on his shoulder that works perfect for your finger so you can kind of like whip his mace around like yeah 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 <laughs> other than that his right other arm is just articulated normally as well as his legs and we got that little squishy, uh, squishy version of Grot Dog there as well. Your regular Grocer King figure. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just a really, really fun figure. I love this guy. Great inclusion to the line. All right, so I always talk about these guys relating to Food Fighters, which is a line that I love from the 80s that I grew up playing with. And these guys definitely remind me of that. So I want to do a little bit of a comparison time to show you the similarities here, like Lice Scream with Sergeant Scoops from Mattel's Food Fighters line from the 80s. How cool is that, seeing these two ice cream guys side by side? And of course, we can have Grot Dog standing alongside Mean Wiener. Now they're doing a little bit different because Mean Wiener's like horizontal and a Grot Dog is uh, vertical, but still, we have two hot dog guys now. And now that the new Grocery Gang figures even kind of have that military theme and the bug strike, they're even more like food fighters. And my gosh, I just love it. I don't know if it's an intentional nod, but to me, it is definitely a nod to one of my all-time favorite toy lines. I love Grocery Gang. These figures are so much fun. Very cool. The action features are great too. Like, oh, there's a rack attack. Get him. Ah! <laughs> oh no. Rack attack's got his little... Bugs to throw. Boom! Oh yeah, he just blasted Grot Dog. But that's okay, because we got Live Scream here. Get him! Boom! Takes him out. Man, see? These are awesome. Great action features, a lot of fun. I know kids love these things. I know my son loves these guys, but man, this is something that I love as well, just because of the toys that it reminds me of from my childhood. I seriously feel like Grocery Gang uh, feels like a toy from the 80s or the early 90s, but out today it's one of my favorite original licenses or original properties that's on store shelves right now and definitely worth checking out if you love the weird oddball stuff like this like i do hey guys thank you so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it please hit the like button leave me a comment let me know what you think of these guys and don't forget to subscribe until next time